Hey, what's up everyone? This is Nash and this is the most requested video of all time. In this video, I'll be showing you how to install any Android custom ROM on any Android device. And if you are new into installing or flashing Android custom ROMs, there are two basic requirements for this method. First of all, your bootloader must be unlocked and you must have TWRP recovery installed in your phone. For this tutorial, I'm going to use my OnePlus One and I'm going to install or flash the most popular ROM in the world, Lineage OS. And before I start, let me tell you, you don't need root access to install any Android custom ROM. So to install any Android custom ROM on your phone, basically you need to download two files. One is ROM file. Another is GAPS, also known as Google Apps, that installs Play Store and various Google Apps into your phone. First of all, let's download the ROM file. For that, you need to go to official Lineage OS website. I will give the link below if you want to follow with me. Once you are into Lineage OS site, just select your device. For me, it's OnePlus One. And then download latest nightlies. Nightlies means the build is updated every night, but don't worry, you don't need to update your phone every night. Now let's download Google Apps Gaps. I always use Open Gaps and I have no problem so far. So once you are into Open Gaps website, make sure to select the correct architecture. For OnePlus One, it's ARM. For OnePlus Three, it's ARM64. Don't forget to Google your device's ARM architecture before you download GAPS. And then we need to select Android version. And because we are downloading latest Lineage OS nightly, it's gonna be latest Android 7.1. And next we need to choose package. I like to keep it minimum, so I choose micro. You can choose whatever you want, it won't make any difference. And as you can see, I have already downloaded Lineage OS file and GAPS file into my phone. Now the next step is we need to boot our phone into custom recovery which is TWRP recovery. And because I am already on some custom ROM, it gives me shortcut to directly boot into recovery by just pressing power button. But if you don't have that option, just power off your device and press power button and volume down button for 10 or 15 seconds and you will boot into TWRP recovery. For different devices, the button combinations are different. So don't forget to google that before you power off your device. And as you can see we are into TWRP recovery and before you do anything into recovery mode you must need to take an Android backup in case anything goes wrong you can restore it back. To perform full Android backup just tap on backup tab and then give it a custom name if you want. and just swipe right normally it takes around 10 to 15 minutes it might take longer if you have many apps Now to install new Android custom ROM, we need to wipe old one. Just go to wipe tab and swipe right and you're good to go. Now you have wiped your current stock ROM or current custom ROM. 
and you have no operating system installed on your phone. Now we are going to install Lineage OS. Go to install tab, locate your downloaded ROM and GAPS file. Select your ROM.zip and tap on add more zip and select GAPS file. Now just swipe right to install Android ROM and Google Apps GAPS. Now just wait for installation to finish. It might take 5 to 10 minutes. And as you can see it's finished now just tap on reboot system now please keep in mind the first boot will take little bit longer once you see boot animation it means you have successfully installed lineage OS on your phone I hope this video was helpful to you if you are installing any Android ROM for first time. Give a like if you appreciate my efforts. And don't forget to subscribe because you can find all type of ROM videos on this channel. This is Nash and I will see you next time.